hey what's up guys welcome back to a brand new video and today we're gonna play some games on the galaxy note 9 and this is the exynos 9810 version of the galaxy note 9 and this one has six gigabytes of ram so we shall see how games like fortnite pubg asphalt 9 asphalt nitro and dead trigger 2 perform on the galaxy note 9 and also i'm shooting this video in 4k with my new sony alpha 6300 so let me know how the video quality is like compared to my older videos so let's go ahead and begin all right guys so before we start gaming on the note 9 first let me tell you what the game launcher does so game launcher will bring all your different games together into this one folder which is game launcher if game launcher is not available on your phone it is probably turned off so all you have to do is go to settings tap on advanced features and go to games and then make sure game launcher is turned on once the game launcher option is turned on it will appear here on the main menu and then you can drag and drop it to your home screen like i have done game launcher is not just a folder here we have some different options so you can discover the games that are available for your galaxy note 9 and we have some popular games over here let's go back you can tweak the performance of the games i prefer having performance mode turned on but then you can tweak individual performance so if i tap over here we can actually go ahead and reduce the frame rate of the game so i can have this run at 25 fps that will consume uh, less battery power and we can also decrease the game's resolution but i don't want all that i want maximum performance so we'll just turn this off and make sure the performance is set to maximum and then you can mute the sound just for the games and if you long press a game and then tap on game details it will take you it will show you some more details like youtube search results worldwide galaxy gamer data and you can see fortnite is actually quite recent the eight weeks ago it's just showing zero players and if you tap on this icon it takes you to your stats all right guys so the first game we're gonna play is yes you guessed it right fortnite and this is one of the most popular games on android right now a lot of people are playing this even if you try and find the match at say 2 a.m in the night you'll be able to find one match with 50 players all right so here we are in the main menu and you can see i've got that galaxy skin this is that exclusive skin which you'll get if you own a galaxy note 9 so if you want to access the recording tools just pull out the nav bar like this and press this icon and here we have some options we can enable no alerts during games i have turned it on and you can block the home button and edge panel here but really the most interesting thing is the ability to record your own gameplay and let's go to settings first let me show you some things and if we go to record videos here you have some different options like you can use the camera to record an image of yourself while you're playing the game it's gonna select none we have the audio source microphone or game resolution 1080p and all that other stuff is there let's go back here so let's press on play again because it just cancelled here we are it loads fairly quickly faster than most of these other players here we go so I'm not, I won't be able to play properly because I'm actually looking at the camera screen while I'm actually playing this so don't really expect any high quality gameplay but let's go ahead and record the gameplay so that we can see how the quality is like so now our gameplay is being recorded so let's go find some weapons what is that? But you can probably see the game is super smooth. No, doesn't seem to be having any troubles running this. And as you can see, even when we are recording the game, the performance seems to be okay. I don't really feel the game lagging or anything. Look at how much depth this thing has. Amazing.
So the next game on my list is Players Unknown Battlegrounds or PUBG. Let's launch. So here we are and the graphics are set to maximum. So HDR and the frame rate is set to high. Let's set it on Ultra and Realistic. Ultra HD is not available, it says coming soon. So okay, okay, let's go back. Let's play the game. Start. All right, so here we are. Super smooth frame rate. Doesn't seem to be having any problems running this game in Ultra. What the heck are these guys doing? All right, here we go. Yeah, and you can see this game is very similar to. Okay, so what's this? Okay, cool. And this game is very similar to Fortnite. All right, now we have to find some stuff. Let's go in here. So let me just start recording so I can show you guys how it looks. I'm a little bit clumsy when it comes to controls. Okay, so I guess you guys get an idea on how it's like. Everything is super smooth. Now I am recording the game right now, so recording is going on. But the game seems to run super smooth without any problems. So there you have it guys, you can actually go ahead and play high quality games like PUBG and even, even though I'm running this game at maximum quality, the phone is having no troubles and you can actually record the gameplay while you're actually playing it. I hope you guys are having fun. So next we have Need for Speed No Limits. Uh oh. I have to mute the sound because otherwise that music in the game is going to cause a copyright claim. It has happened before. All you need to do is mute the music. So pause and turn off music. Tap on resume. Now we can have the sound enabled. Let's start recording. How do you use nitros in this? All right, here we are. Guys, just look at these graphics. The game looks beautiful on this phone. So this was Need for Speed, well so far so good, the phone is performing like a champ. Next we have Asphalt 9. Ok, 
Okay, double tap to spin. There's no double tap nitro on this. Alright guys, so this was Asphalt 9, now let's go ahead and play another game. So next we have Asphalt Nitro. Look at that. You know guys, I am a really lousy driver, maybe I shouldn't be allowed to drive cars in real life. Okay, I see your nitros. Let's try and grab this. Oh yeah. Oh, I missed that one. Uh oh, I missed another one. Come on. And I missed this one as well. Oh yeah, got this one. So the last game we'll be running on the phone is Dead Trigger 2, one of my favorite zombie games, zombie killing games I should say. So let's play. Guys, just look at those graphics. I have a feeling this guy is going to turn into a zombie. Oh, I told ya, he's turned into a zombie. What is that? Is it human? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not good, not good. Underground car park. Okay. Oh. These guys turned into a zombie as well. All zombies? Oh, 
How do you fire? Okay, so it's like auto firing. Are you jump over this? So guys, this is Dead Trigger 2 and I hope you guys get an idea on how the gameplay is like on the Galaxy Note 9. It, yeah, this, this phone is able to run even the most powerful and high-end games like PUBG and you guys just saw me playing that game Fortnite. Alright, so I hope you guys liked the video and I hope you guys have enjoyed it and thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.